What is going on YouTube? In this video today, we're gonna to be going over why you should not be streaming Fortnite if you are a new streamer. Now, this is something I wanted to cover for some time now. I wanted to give it a little bit of a chance for me to stream Fortnite on Twitch before I just completely got rid of the idea of streaming Fortnite and moved on to games with a smaller channel and viewer value. Now, I thought just because I was decent at Fortnite that some people would wanna watch, but what I started finding out is that it's pretty much impossible for newer people to find you if you're stacked at the bottom of the list. And I'm gonna be going over something today, which is like a little tracker system that is gonna show you exactly what I'm talking about. So without further ado, let's get right into it. All right, so what you're gonna do is uh, go up to the top here, and you're gonna be going to a website called Twitch Strike. Okay, so we can just do Twitch Strike. Now we can just Google it in right here. It's gonna be the first one that ends up popping up. So then right here, you get sent to this interface. Now this essentially shows you the best games to stream right now and the worst. Okay, so just a little overview. If you wanna find this at first, you can go up to the top here where it says guides, click on that, and then you can click on what not to stream on Twitch. All right, and this takes you in to this little database right now where it pretty much shows you the viewers to channel ratio and it'll give you sort of like an insight right here. So right here, how this says 11 channels, but then it also says amount of viewers the top 5% own. So that seems like a pretty decent one, right? There's only 11 channels, there's a lot of viewers, high ratio. But the only reason that people are watching this game currently is because of one streamer that they must like, because 100% of the viewers right now are going into this guy. So everyone else doesn't even have a viewer, essentially, on this. Um, so now let's type in Fortnite because that's the one that we are going to look at. Type in Fortnite into the box. Click on it right here. Now you see there is 4,790 channels right here. That is a ton, okay? Now there's 22,646 viewers, which is also a ton, but that that is not even close to the amount that we would get in the channel. So with the ratio here, the ratio here is five. So that is if every single streamer were all like together and grouped together and they had the same amount of viewers, everyone would have five. All right. Now that's completely awful. <laughs> now here, I'm going to explain why here in a second. Now, if we go to Twitch, okay, and then we see the Fortnite thing over here, 132K viewers, that is a ton of viewers. Now you go right here, okay? Now the top people have like a decent amount of viewers, all right, but let's see how long you have to scroll for to find the people with zero to five viewers. All right, so we're still going down, we're going down, now we're still into the hundreds, and there are very few people that stream with like 100 viewers or more, okay? That's that's pretty rare and that's actually pretty good and you see how long we're just scrolling with the people that have this many viewers no one is going to scroll down this long and find your thing and the, the less viewers you get the more people there are with those viewers so guys we're literally still scrolling who is going to go down here and scroll this long to find your thing <laughs> like we're still going down and the people that have like five viewers who is gonna who's gonna find you on this one guys like it, no one is gonna find you streaming this game unless you're like a cash cup winner or someone hosts you or you're just in the top like one percent of this game now let's go to another game like let's just type in resident evil 3 78 viewers but do you see how little channels there are for this game so someone types in resident evil 3 and wants to see it right now 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 there's only a 78 viewers you might think that that's garbage but if you had zero to five looking at you and now you got the chance for some of these 78 to come here and look at you that's that's gonna be huge so that is pretty much it if you want my uh my tip on what i would do if you were a newer streamer starting out i would find a smaller niche game like even resident evil 3 i mean i think that's a good one that you can start out if you're at like zero to five maybe rack up like 20 viewers in a session if people end up liking you but my recommendation would not to be do fortnite 
All right, I, I would not do that at all. I wouldn't even start out with it unless you're like already ranked in the game or have a bunch of subscribers. I'm gonna be starting a new game on Twitch in the following weeks. I'm pretty excited to roll it out. I'm making everything right now towards that game and OBS and making sure I have everything ready before I roll it out and stream it. A um, lot smaller of a niche game. Um, so if you want to see that, you can go ahead and add me on Twitch at Not Morans. Hopefully you found this video helpful and you can help out one of the other smaller Fortnite streamers if they actually want to grow their channel, get into something new. All right. Alrighty. And I will catch you guys next time.